Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is for Friday, July 26th. I'm James Spann. The pattern looking pretty dry for the state through the weekend and really much of next week. Rain amounts probably not that heavy. Check things out this morning. We still have the ridge in the west, the trough in the east. And we still have a pretty comfortable morning across the state. Temperatures are in the 60s, not quite as cool as recent mornings. 61 for Gadsden and Fort Payne, Birmingham 68. Highs 87 to 90 today. There's the watch warning map. It's a very quiet midsummer morning. Got some heat issues over the valleys of California, and that's about it. Chance of severe storms up around the Canadian border. Around here, most of the state dry. There could be an isolated storm near the Gulf Coast. Even there, not much rain. Same thing tomorrow. And then Sunday, all of Alabama goes in the green. And I guess there might be an isolated shower over the north, but most communities will probably stay dry. In fact, it's really a dry pattern for a while. This is the rain for the next seven days, showing not that much down here. The better rain's up north. Rain amounts, if this is correct, under a quarter of an inch. Although I do think we'll see a little bump in the number of scattered showers and storms on Tuesday of next week. And uh, as parts of the state could use some rain. Now, as you know, rain amounts are very variable across the state. Some places last week had flash flooding. Some places had nothing. We've got a few little spots with drought conditions south of Birmingham and also down in southeast Alabama. This is the new drought monitor released yesterday. Tropics, no worries. Atlantic Basin, very quiet for the foreseeable future. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS. This is the 06E run at 4 o'clock this afternoon. Upper high back in the southwest, kind of a broad trough in the southeast. And again, a dry air mass. Sunny highs 87 to 90. Really not much change tomorrow. We'll be close to 90. The sky's sunny. Humidity values tick up a little bit. And even Sunday looks dry for most of the state. Could there be a little speck somewhere on radar? Yes, but odds of any one place getting wet, I'd say less than 10%. And again, the high should be pretty close to 90. Monday, better chance of showers with a short wave west of the state. And then Tuesday, that seems to be the one day where scattered storms could increase a bit. Even then, it's not going to rain everywhere. Highs in the upper 80s, and then Wednesday, we trend a little drier. This is Thursday. That looks quiet. And a week from today, we've got the big upper high in the west, a little upper low over the northern Gulf, and again, that's just not showing that much rain here. The better chance of showers will be east of here if this verifies. Let's go out 10 days. This is Sunday, the 4th of August. Same idea. Heights below average here, ridging in the west, and again, that looks like a pretty standard summer pattern with Maybe a few scattered storms there in the afternoon. QPF off the GFS Ensemble for Birmingham. We're looking at the mean, the green line. Really not much for 15 days. That's under one and a half inches. But the heat level's not bad for a dry pattern. Most days, upper 80s and low 90s and lows mostly in the upper 60s. That is very bearable for the time of the year where typically the heat levels are at their highest. That's it for the Weather Extreme video today. I'll be out live at uh, Free Friday Flicks this evening, so just one video today. We'll have some forecast notes later this afternoon on the blog. If you can't catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend, and God bless. AS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort.